<laughs> the category is Say My Name. Makes exceedingly good cakes. That is their slogan. Oh, I feel Mary Berry. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning beauty. This is how I feel today. Like I want to hide in my hoodie. What is this weather? Like what is this weather? Rain has come. The beachy hair has gone. <laughs> I washed my hair today and it felt so good. Shining is sleek now. I've put all the serum in. I've done a nice Philip Kingsley mask earlier. So my hair's feeling good. But yeah, this weather has already massively affected my mood, which I know I shouldn't let it, but I've achieved nothing. Let's do something productive. I have a new Hoover. I have a new Hoover. The Dyson has officially arrived. I have used it a good few times, but I'm gonna have more of a play with it today. I really wanna like Hoover and clean the settee because, and like flip the cushions and stuff. I mean, I, I can't keep up with what day it is right now. I put out the all the bins last night to realize that it's not bin day until tomorrow. <laughs> It's Tuesday. It definitely feels like a Monday though, doesn't it? All right, we need to make the bed. <laughs> Randomly got shoes and my bunny on my bed. I literally hugged my little bunny last night when I was in bed. He's so cute and honestly, he's so cozy. He's the best cuddler, aren't you? I got some new shoes sent from Miss Selfridge. I have got brand new fresh sheets on and yes, I am putting shoes on my bed. <laughs> but to be fair, they've never been worn. How gorgeous are these? I've put the links on my Instagram stories if you do want to check them out and i'll pop them below as well but yeah really nice chunky heel i know that i will wear these so much and fun fact i have super wide feet when i find shoes that are wide fit honestly makes my day because these will be so comfy and i know that i'll be able to like walk around town in these all day and then also these are so cute like little woven pointed sandals and they have these tight around goes right up the leg around the ankle hopefully i can wear these on holiday when we go and get away from this absolute disgusting weather can you hear the rain it has not stopped all day it's so dark i'm gonna need to put the light on can you hear that how has it gone from two days ago i was sweating sitting in the garden oh england i saw this bed making challenge on tiktok where the best thing to do to make it look like a hotel bed is actually pull it really tight wait let's take these off all right and then tuck in this side see it already does actually look so good so much flatter and then we put the cushions on top we're gonna finish with bunny today you can take pride of place Right, we have all these different attachments for the Dyson. I got the Animal V7, which I got on QVC. It was a really good price. Um, but there's all these different attachments. I don't really know what they do. And I can't find out in the paperwork. It doesn't actually say. So I'm just going to have a play. We'll find out. I don't know what to clean the settee, settee with. Do we reckon this one? This one looks like it might be good. I can't tell you how excited I was to get this. This is so much more quieter. Oh, there's a suite down there. <laughs> I can't tell you how much quieter this is than the Vax that I used to use. I could never be without a cordless now. They are a game changer. That's good look at that and it also gets so cold in this flat so i always have throws over me when i'm sitting on the sofa but because i'm sitting on the sofa every night and being really rubbish i putting them away for a minute how beautiful are these flowers as well i've had them for like a week and a half and they still look beautiful these ones are from a uh, tides it's a shop in brentwood really cute but the beads are starting to come off now which is very annoying i keep finding them on the settee all right i have no idea what one will be best i'm thinking this one i might be completely wrong though so let's see this is doing the trick can you see all the beads that are coming out cushions are starting to really sag so I'm gonna take them all off and like flip them around. This is definitely probably the most worn seat as I always sit in the corner. It dips down so bad. <gasps> no 
Oh, okay, this looks good with the lines. Um, I've just noticed there are like a couple of stains. I feel like that's probably chocolate or something. So I'm gonna try and get them out, but I don't really have any proper, I don't know. I don't know what you normally clean a sofa with. I'm just gonna take a little bit of my, you might be screaming at the video right now saying no, but let's see if this works. It's trial and error right now. I'm gonna spray all the settee down with my Febreze fabric spray to really freshen it up. If you're wondering, my sofa is from Sofa Club. It is the comfiest sofa and I love all of the stud detailing of it. Like, I do love this sofa so much. Oh, have I just made it worse? Well, no, I think that has worked. That has definitely worked. Perfect. Right, let's do it on this side. Oh God. I mean, my cleaning videos aren't very helpful as I just make it up as I go along, but that stain has now come out. I'm a genius. You know what? I'm gonna YOLO. <laughs> I might regret this, but... <laughs> well, this is brightening up my Tuesday. <laughs> I guess you don't really think about all the crap that really falls behind the sofa. This was definitely overdue. Such a twat. Didn't realise I can't turn around the cushions because there is no cushion on the back. Great. <laughs> That's okay, I'm still gonna pull them all out. I feel like that brush one was really good on the fabric, but it wasn't really doing the job on this. Whereas this one is, I mean, Pretty amazing. I feel like every room in the flat right now is just a mess. I feel like all I'm doing is tidying it up and then I make a mess and then I tidy up and then I make a mess again. But also my dishwasher broke this morning. Honestly, this is now the fourth thing to break in self-isolation, but it's all good. At least this one isn't actually crucial, you know? I can wash up, that's okay even though that is very long. So that looks good. We've got the decorative cushions on either side because these are the ends where no one really sits. So I don't want these ones to get ruined so they can stay there. And then we've got them cushions that come with the settee in the corner. So the, the settee is actually now looking really freaking good. I need to clean this table. So that's next on the list. But actually let's do the little footstool of this as well. Right, this is exactly the same um, as the settee. So I don't know why I just put so much on there. That was quite unnecessary to be honest, <laughs> but it smells great. And then I just like to pop my, this is from Ikea actually. Um, I just pop that on top. I love my books here. So I've got my Dior one, which is this one, which my friend Jenna got me and my De Beers one, which I actually got at a De Beers event I went to. And then my Infini flowers. These flowers actually last for a year. They are so, so pretty. And then I've just got my Diptyque candle, which I never liked, but it looks super pretty. So <laughs> I'm just using this uh, Citrus Shine antibacterial cleaner at the minute. I don't know if that's the best, but it seems to do the job and a little microfiber cloth. It's all fresh. Also, if you're wondering, my coffee table is also from Tides in Brentwood. I absolutely love it. And I just cleaned the chrome with the Dettol all in one. So spray this over and then I can go over with my cloth. It just brings it up really, really nice. Now probably one of my favorite purchases in my flat. I love my TV stand so much. I feel like it's just so different. It's actually a console table, but when I measured it, I realized it would be the perfect length. It literally fits in this corner just like it's so perfect. It's from a company called, I think it's Furniture365. I will leave the link below. Let's go again over this with the Dettol spray and my cloth 
to polish it up. It's very like art deco, you know, at the bottom. I love it. This has actually become a living room clean with me and I, I didn't even mean to. <laughs> Uh, this sign is, uh, I've got this from the girls Elizabeth Arden, they sent it for their 5th Avenue fragrance and I love it, so yeah, this is taking pride of place there. And then I have my wax melt diffuser, I love this so much, um, I haven't actually changed this in forever, so I'm going to change that, I think I got this from Amazon, so I'll try and find the link, it was ages ago, but I love it because it never like heats up too much that it gets dangerous, so you can just leave it on without worrying and it creates such a beautiful fragrance get a knife and kind of prise it out so this is what it looks like once it's all dried my set of side tables is from wayfair hardly ever use them to be fair so i'm just using the astonished window and glass to clean that but it's nice to have my photo frame on and also the wax melt i'm excited to get a new one on get this Smelling good in here. I know I've been trying to hide this corner, but I will hide it no more. It is one big, huge, massive mess. This is my desk right now. Let's clear it. I've got my lights back here for when I do my uh, YouTube live, so I can take that out and put that away until Friday. My answers from the quiz I done with my friends last night. Got some OPI, of course. I normally do my nails here, so we've got some remover, we've got the bubble bath, which I need to pop on actually today, lip gloss, sunglasses, these are Polaroid. I have the makeup that I wore to the live Friday. This can all be taken away. Yeah, this can all be cleared. Spray it with this little citrus shine spray. Oh, yes. They do say you work so much better when you have a clear workspace. So now I have a completely clear desk. Oh, how much better. Right, so I've got my memory cards in there for my camera. Tissues. I need to get a cute tissue box holder to put that in. And then I am going to leave a few products because I paint my nails with Nail Envy every day at the minute. And then constantly apply my oil. So I'm going to leave them there and also just my pen i'm gonna neatly try and put my headphones maybe i could put them over the tissue box <laughs> is that gonna look stupid sometimes i do need these if i'm like trying to concentrate um and my ones for my iphone don't fit in the mac anymore because it's the old school oh they look quite cool actually <laughs> Or is that just me? It feels so much better. That took a little bit of elbow grease washing that up. So definitely wouldn't recommend leaving it as long as I did. I'm going to put another one of my Glade wax melts in here. The one I love is this cashmere woods i mean i love the cinnamon ones as well but cashmere woods is like a good all year round one it's just so cute because it's like a little light but it also just smells so good like this will fill the whole room and my flat to be honest i mean still haven't done everything i haven't done the fireplace maybe we should do that another day i don't really know how i go about cleaning that but everything else is super clean fresh looking good let me know what you guys have done to get through this rainy day i'm gonna sit down tonight with some fajitas a hot chocolate and watch celebrity sas because oh, it's just one of my favorite programs so i'm so glad it's back let me know what you guys are watching and i will see you tomorrow bye